Welcome. We're going to listen to pieces taken from this book, Trinity's Grade 2 from 2023, the extended edition. There are 21 pieces in here altogether, but I'm only going to play nine because 12 of them are also in their standard edition book, and I've done a separate video on that. I reckon slightly 21 pieces in a single video could be too much. So these are the nine pieces that you will find only in this extended edition. I'm sure you're aware that you can also select from the 21 pieces in the from 2021 books as well. And there are another 14 pieces dotted around in various publications. So you've got 56 pieces in all to play from. We're going to listen to just nine of them here. So in this video, I'm just going to play straight through them. There are individual videos on each piece too that go into a little bit more detail. And there are tutorials available to purchase too, if you wish. And finally, a word on speed. I'm going to follow the metronome marks indicated in the exam booklet. A hornpipe by Henry Purcell to start with. And as it says at the top, bright and jolly, this has a real dancing swagger about it. And the exam booklet asks us to observe the first repeat, those first four bars, but not the second. And that's how I'll play it now. Fantasia by Telemann. On the face of it, it looks quite straightforward. It's certainly a lot less notes than the piece I've just played. And there's quite a lot of repetition as well. The first two bars. Bars three and four. Bars five and six. And guess what for bars seven and eight? So it seems quite straightforward. And there are other elements of repetition here as well. But as ever, we've got to work out, am I playing smooth here? Am I slightly detached? Am I very detached? Ah. Melodic Study by Gurlitt, and we have a tune here and some accompaniment chord shapes in the left hand, and we need to have the right balance so that the tune sings out. And it's marked dolce, very sweetly and quiet up at the start.
La Machine à Coudre, The Sewing Machine by Mel Bonis, Mel Melanie Bonis. Um, it's from a collection of pieces she wrote pour les tout petits, and I've recorded one or two others of these too. You might like to check the link down below. A sewing machine that would have been controlled by our feet and had a big wheel, and the big wheel is clearly indicated by our left hand. Our last piece was quite fast. That's Machine à Coudre by Mel Bonis. This tale by Samuel Maikapa is also quite quick and lots of staccato notes here. long leap down to find that bass note right at the very end there. Die Nacht im Wald, Night in the Woods by Alexander Gedik. And so much music takes us somewhere, tells us a story. And this one, I certainly have a very clear image of a slightly scary walk in the woods at night. The Broken Clock by Adrian Sutton. And our left hand is trying to keep the pulse. But those interval of a tone, two notes next door to each other, they somehow suggest that things aren't quite right. And later on in the piece, we get some semitone crunches as well. Do it sound even more wrong somehow? It's very rarely right, I think, to play a piece with a metronome. But this is one of these pieces that it, it could work in your practice, playing it with the metronome, keeping you strictly in time. Let's see what you think. We talked about setting the metronome in the last piece. When you set your metronome to find the speed for this one, it's fast. It's 132 beats per minute. Though we do get a bit slower at the end and a strong bluesy feel. And I love 
the sound of the bass note right at the very end. We began with music written in the 1600s and finally writings on the wall from the Bond film Spectre, famously sung by Sam Smith and co-written by him too. Thank you for being with me as we looked at these nine pieces in the extended edition of Trinity's Grade 2 from 2023 Piano Syllabus. There are plenty of links down below if you'd like to look at other pieces, perhaps the exercises or the scales. Take care, enjoy your piano practice. Bye bye for now.